As always at this event, ISPS Handa gives the PGA a shop window for the splendid work it does for disabled golf. There are many who love the game, and the PGA tries to identify how best to tailor its help. The big thing is to kind of ask a question, where would they like to go with golf, really? You know, you're dealing here with a lot of determined individuals and they, you know, they don't want to be seen as any different to, to any other golfer that I would teach. So, so it's really having that initial conversation as to where do they want to go. And then we sort of agree a plan between us and we just find the right a way which suits them best. A number of very competitive elite disabled golfers have benefited greatly from PGA assistance and with plenty of practice, their standard is remarkable. You never master it, do you? It's golf for you. Um, but I, I've been getting better over the last sort of few years. I've, you know, my handicap's down to 11.8 now, which is very important. It's below 12 now. It's on, on its way down to 9, which is where I want to be. It's been a long process because getting, getting the clubs made was the uh, original hurdle when I was younger, but uh, we got there. Got there, he did. Tony Lloyd from Telford is a prime example of the dedication required and the excellent quality of golf that can be achieved. Fantastic, that, isn't it? He's a three-time European champion uh, and you know multi-winner of you know club events and, and other disabled events. So Tony's progressed a, a tremendous amount. His confidence levels have grown. I think the fact that being around more people has helped to, to, to grow that confidence and, and make him a stronger golfer. When some of the European Senior Tour players were invited to try and use Tony's clubs and technique, the results were illuminating. It's a different way of looking at it because you are literally looking down the hole of the shaft where you're not looking down at hands and then a shaft. So I guess it's, it's, the, it's, the, it's the visual as much as anything else, which is why you see so many of them miss with the first shot. With disabled golf now firmly established, the desire is for IOC recognition and ultimately inclusion as a Paralympic medal sport. There's a lot of work going on behind the scenes around the Paralympics and you know we, we feel we're getting you know the right things together and you know it won't be too long since we were you know hopefully we'll be able to put something to the you know, the IGF and, and then hopefully the IPC and, and see it there in you know in the future. In that and in all of their future endeavours, we wish them well. <laughs>